Hello, welcome to Beth Roars, where we look at your favourite singers to find out what makes them them. Before we start, you can find me on Facebook, Twitter and Instagram. My handle is at Beth Roars and I hold loads of votes on my Instagram so you guys can vote on who I react to. Also, please do check out my website, BethRoars.com, where you can book a singing lesson from me. And last but not least, please do head over to my Patreon, which is Patreon.com slash BethRoars, where you can get some more exclusive content, you can get early access to my podcast, and you can also find out a little bit more about my scholarship fund for aspiring artists. This one might be a little bit scary. It is the most intimidating musicians in rock. I mean, that guy was pretty intimidating. I think it's the um, the face paints mostly, but I feel like if I met him in a dark alley, I would be a little terrified. <laughs> I don't know if that's intimidating. I find that quite funny, that high note. I feel like the first one, Maybe because it's like more gentle and like, oh, and low. Oh, this guy who's up on the screen now from Ramstein. Oh, he's got blood all over him. I'm not sure I like that. I like him. He's kind of creepy, but. He's got like a little bit of like vibrato going on. I really like him. I feel like. You know, clean him up, he'd be all right. He's okay. What's he doing? So much blood. It's something about those lower ones for me that are more scary because they're like, like it's like a monster. Whereas when someone's like, ah, I'm like, you're a human. I can fight you. I could not fight anyone. <laughs> the worst. This one just makes me want to dance. Okay, I love your votes on who you think is the most intimidating. Like, please do put it in the comment. Put, like, number one or number four. So far, actually, my first one, the first one for me has been the most intimidating, I think. I mean, this is great. This is great. I think when people are like actually singing, my like vocal coach brain happens and I'm like, yay. And when it's like distortions and metal distortions, I'm like, oh, scary, scary. Oh my God. Yeah, that's intimidating. The guitarist is intimidating. Like if you walked down that alleyway and then you saw that scene with the crosses and the fire and the blood, you would, I would be terrified. Yeah, I, uh, it's, that's scary. Yeah, this is always, it's the flashing lights. 
Ooh, and that noise at the end, the flashing lights, and it's it feels a bit manic, like you're like, it feels, yeah, manic. Oh gosh, I've done reactions to this guy before. didn't even uh, do a crazy scream. I wanted like a big metal scream, although I have to admit the backing was the most terrifying to me. Okay, so I think that my most intimidating one personally, I think was number three. So please put down in the comments what you think was your scariest, most intimidating metal rock vocalist. But I'd also like to see what you thought was the best vocalist. I'm really interested as to who are people's favorite metal rock vocalists. So pop that in the comments below. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, please do like and subscribe and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.